surface Off my phone, I don't care about surface On the inside, deep down, no one hurts huh? Temptations in front of me, the lock down Coming into this one, can he hit 50? That's what we're wondering right there on the cut line. Can they hit that 50 goal mark? That would be a fun storyline to track what? as we inch closer and closer to puck drop. Ray Ferraro will join me up in the broadcast booth in just a few minutes. We'll get his thoughts as we get ready. All right, let's take a look at some of the final scores in the league tonight. The Kings were in a dogfight on the road up against the Sharks. San Jose took this one thanks to a beautiful performance in goal and the shutout win. The Sins took to the road to match right. up with the Coyotes. Ottawa pulverized. This might be a little... It has been all about the winning streak as of late for the home team. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. What can you say? The hottest team in hockey looks to take to the ice and keep it going tonight. The Red Wings will look to go on the offensive as they win the opening draw. The Jets gain possession in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Connor. Winnipeg's on the attack and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Here's a chance! Oh, he comes up oh. with a stop! Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Takes control of the puck. Quick pass to Larkin. Sends it in front! Off a stick and they can't complete the play. Ehlers gains the line and into the offensive zone. the puck. Gostas Bears taking it from his own end. You gotta figure he knows about this next milestone. He's only one goal away. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. Now the name of his game is Speed James and he can move at the same speed with the puck as he does without it. It's one of his factors of his game that is so difficult to defend. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. Winnipeg's first half of the season was excellent, James. They're exactly where they wanted to be. If you could have written it up at the beginning of the year, this is where they would have said they wanted to be. Now it's about pushing and elevating because you know it gets harder, and the veterans certainly know it. So they'll have to lead by example and push this team down the stretch. And that's intercepted by Brossois. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. While we have a moment in the action, let's check in with tonight's pound for pound. Cheryl? I love it when players of similar style go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, James, or really head-to-head, -head, because you can really evaluate them and see who's elevated their game at the right time, really trusting in the process, buy into the coach's plan, and making a key difference in the outcome of the game. Penalty coming up here. The Jets are going to serve two for tripping here. Teams lining up for the face-off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. They haven't scored on their power play yet. They've earned this opportunity. They'll get another look at it, look for different adjustments to be made. Excellent stick work on the play. Takes it across the blue line. For point blank! Great stuff by Brisbane! What the? Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. 
Apollo's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Larkins won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Let's it go. Turned aside with the glove. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Larkins ready to take the trot here on this power play. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Well, Lardy's got it across the line. <laughs> Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Petrie. Play is called for offside. <laughs> I am follows recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. <laughs> and play resumes as the puck is dropped. Takes the pass. Detroit's got the puck against the half wall. Oh. Shuts the door with a great save. Slides the paddle in there and pokes it away. Back in her instead of the goal. Right with the man advantage, and they make it click. can't remember the last time a goal's been scored against him, James, but that's going to do it. That's going to end the streak, but he has been unbelievable. Tracking, dialed in, and making so many amazing saves. Detroit's hard work pays off as they get on the board first here tonight. Yeah, getting on the board first over halfway through the first period, and you know, there has been much going on here in this game. It's been back and forth, but it's starting to open up with this first goal. Got to hope that there's some more offense in this one. And he stopped that one. Francois, timing of that save is incredible. I mean, you have to find a way to build on save after save. And he's coming oh, off that yeah. shutout performance, so everyone in the building knows what he can do. Slides the puck to Larkin. And now he tries to get it across to Dabrinkit. Here's a shot, and that's deflected off someone in front. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Oh, he gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. Takes the bank feed. First pass leads to the offense. That's a great one. Oh, how did he stop that with a save by Brissois? Scooped up along the wall by Sider. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the Come stick. On. Oh, nice use of the boards with the bank pass. Here's a chance. And that's off target as it hits a body. Detroit's got the puck in their own end. Sends a pass over. They've got numbers here. Deflected away. Oh. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. A chance. And he blocks that one. Look at this, they've got some bodies here on the attack. Let's go! Alex to break it! Break it. We don't get many odd man rushes throughout a game, James. You have to capitalize on your opportunity. I thought they executed perfectly. They didn't overpass. The right player took the right shot. Detroit's on a mission tonight. Boy, do they look dialed in. They look dialed in, and they look fast. There's so much motion. Everyone is no, moving, and when they're moving, they're disrupting coverage and giving themselves lots of looks at the net, and they've been rewarded with a couple goals. Dumps it into the Ozone. Detroit's got a hold of it along the wall. He's got a chance. Oh, oh. break away. Oh, I'm not really sure what happened there. It looks to me like he couldn't make up his mind what he wanted to do, and in the interim, he ran out oh. of space. Takes the feed. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Red Wings take it along the wing. Picked up along the wall by Dabrinkit. Puts it on net. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Larkin's been lighting the lamp at this point streak, playing so confident. He knows where he is on the ice, and it just seems that every time it makes its way towards the net, the puck's going in. 
Detroit's offense has been on fire to start this one and still lots of time left in the first. And they win the face off and set up to go on the attack. And he denied him there. Shot, denies oh. him again. Oh. In the box in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Wasa's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Larkin's greatest asset is his speed. His wheel zone ability means he can really fly when he's got the space to move. Connor's wheel zone ability means he's so fast even when skating with the puck. Look to one of these players to be a difference maker in this one. Back up to the booth. Taken along the wall by Petrie. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Oh, and there's a great save by Let's go! Cool. Stars, and look who's at it again. They are really turning up the heat. Uh, so creative and free. And the reason why you can play free, because you're playing with a ton of confidence. Not afraid to put the puck to the net, and of course, retrieve it. A great shot is going to beat the goaltender here, James, but he drops to that butterfly position. He tries to take up most of the net, but the shooter just finds it, finds a little bit of room, and buries it. Detroit's got a hold of the puck off the draw. The Red Wings have it in the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Connor. Moves the puck. Back at the point, they set it up. Tremendous save by Brislav. Takes a shot. Oh, they do it again. What a great job of tracking the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Made the stop on that play. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one and then the second save. Coughs it up on the play. And now it's over to Dabrinkit. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Into the attacking area from the left side. And a textbook pass save there. Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Quick feed to Strong. number two in moments. The Red Wings have generated a lot of pucks on net and have turned more than a few of those shots into goals. Well, here we go with the start of period number two. Let's see if the ice is still tilted here. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? The Red Wings are winning this game after 20 because they are relentlessly pressuring their opponent. When you do that, you put them in vulnerable spots, and guess what? You make them move it quicker than they want to, forcing bad decisions. Moves it to the break. Oh, he made the save. How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. Well, the youngster has shown at times that he can be a bright lights player, and in this moment, what's the coach saying here to the kid? Now the coach is saying one thing. We don't need any fancy toe drags right now. Rookie, you make sure that you're smart with the puck and use your brain. The Red Wings have put a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead here early in the second. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers strummed up. Big save in front. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We are in blowout territory right now. It's 5 0. Winnipeg's won the face off deep in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Morrissey. Connors gained the line and on the attack. And he's it on the blue line. Oh, tried to pick his corner and puts it off the outside of the post. Winnipeg's working hard, even they're down just a bunch of goals in this one, but they need something, they need a spark, and I'll tell you what isn't a spark when it goes off the post. We got a stop and just the puck sails over the glass. Detroit's offense has come to play in a big way as they dominated both the shots and goal category. Puck ready to drop here any moment to get things underway again. 
puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Jets have it now. Tries to get it to DeMello. Detroit's got the puck. Puck picked up. James just so dialed in. He's showing a ton of confidence with the puck. You can see it in his body language. Why he had a hot last game and he gets on the board again tonight. Delia's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. The Red Wings lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. And they take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. Detroit's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Takes a shot, and the traffic neutralizes that throw. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. The setters will glide into the dot. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here. They score! The pylon continues, Cheryl. Oh, it is ugly, and there's nothing worse than the score than having your own crowd just give way on you. They are not happy. You can hear the booing tonight in this building. Just a tough game all the way around. I think they screamed uncle about two of these ago. Yeah. 
Here's a short pass to Richie. Receives the pass. Takes the feed. Quick feed to Gustafson. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Answered the call there. Rister. Oh, turns it aside once again. Oh, man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. And a solid stop on the play there. The Jets play it along the wing. Sends it out front. Can't connect the play. Husso's going to hang on for a whistle. Detroit's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. Off the face off, they take the puck. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Here's a save by Delia. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Detroit's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. And he takes the pass. Dabrink has crossed the line and gained the zone. There's the whistle, we've got an offside. Detroit's offense has come to shine here tonight as we look at the score here late in the second. And they've got the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. And he takes the feed. Winnipeg's got it along the wall. Snaps one here on the slot. Husso's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. The Red Wings continue to put lots of pucks on net here, and they lead it late in the second. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Both teams ready in here for the faceoff. Shifley's gained possession, and his great work inside the faceoff circle pays off again. Picked up along the boards by DeMello. And that pass is stolen. Detroit's been so impressive tonight. They're stealing pucks. They're finding ways to put them in. And it's been a blowout. Coach has got to be impressed. Broken up by Hall. Grabbed along the boards by Shifley. And he gets in front of that. Detroit's got possession of the puck. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Gaining momentum along the wing. a smile from the coach as the rookie makes his way back to the bench. Well, yeah, and this is positive reinforcement, and I love that he's getting this, James, because earlier they had a conversation about the specific instruction and expectations on that shift, and when you go out and you execute, then you come back to the bench, and you're kind of looking at your coach, and they give you that reinforcement, it's a great feeling. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. What a steal in his own end. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Change lines! Change lines! Walden's moving the puck through his own zone. And sends it just out of reach. Puck said down the ice, we'll get an icing. Detroit's got to be happy with where their game is at so far tonight as they continue to lead big here late in the second. Winnipeg's got it in the offensive zone. The coach and team reminding each other that this is a critical face-off. Anytime you've got your opponent on their heels after an icing, you have to find a way to have urgency and attack. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. And now it's grabbed by Ehlers. Carries 
the puck through the neutral zone. Second period nearly in the books here. That opportunity is rejected. Here we go, one man rush. And that pass goes off a stick. Detroit's gained possession along the boards. Moves it to the middle. and we've got a third period just around the corner. If you'd like to rub shoulders with some of our players, don't forget to go to our website and check out our <laughs> Welcome back. James Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. <laughs> Slides it across to Ehlers. Gains the zone from the right side. Good defensive stop with the poke chip. Detroit's been a dominant force offensively. Plenty of quality scoring opportunities, and they lead it big time early in the third. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Red Wings lead this one early in the third period. They have been the more aggressive team offensively with the lead in the shot department. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Turn that chance aside. He got all of that one. They gain the zone from the left side. Moves it to Ehlers. And he takes the feed. With possession along the wall. The centermen glide into position. And they win the draw in their own end. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. How did he stop that one? As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Takes the puck at the point. Here's a shot. Too much traffic in the lane. Tosses it on to Wallman. And that pass attempt is deflected. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Center and feed. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. The Red Wings will play it for the corner. A beautiful read in the defensive end by Delia. The Red Wings have a significant lead here in the third period. They have brought their A game tonight. Larkins won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Great save by the goaltender on that one. Musa quickly over to Perfetti. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Taken by Debrinkit. Sends it over to Morrissey. Quick pass to Ayafala. And he loses control of the puck. Here's a shot. 
denies him with the pad. Larkin's determination on the puck, even though he stumbled and has a lack of balance, really shows right there, James, as he finds a way to get that pass through to the shooter. And he gets down to block it. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Breaks up the play with a poke check. and makes the save. Larkin's got the puck in his own zone. Here's the pass in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Change him off, change him off. Slides it diagonally to Shifley. Great reach with the poke check by Sider. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Larkin's got it along the wing. Fires it on the oh, What a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. The Red Wings continue to bring up the score here in period number three. Well, it's just been a terrific collective effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. and that desperation save, unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet, but when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. Slides it quickly to Connor. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Pick shot, denies him! Huso's able to square up to the shooter right here, who's in a dangerous position in the slot area. What a great save, James. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Passes it to Debrinkit. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Takes the shot. Oh, spectacular stop there. The Jets gain control of the puck. And he takes the dish. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Through center. Puck scooped up by Ehlers. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. And he's got the answer for that one. Boston's coming up next on the schedule, and these two teams, doesn't matter where they are in the schedule, where they are in the standings, always a good contest. I'm looking forward to that. The Jets win it. Snaps one from the slot. Answered the call on that play. Gets it over to Debrinkit. Into the offensive zone down the right wing. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Delia. Well, he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner slot. Oh, what a save on the play. Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. And these fans are still buzzing about what we just saw. What a save that was, Cheryl. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. Final horn sounds, and we are all done with this one. And the win streak comes to an abrupt end as they... Congratulations again, uh, 50 goals in the season. You know, to this day, and it's always been revered as that magical mark. Ever since Rocket Richard hit it, how many years ago? And here we are, even now, after all these years, even in a different century, we still look to 50 as being a magical number in the National Hockey League. So congratulations on hitting 50.
That's one time when you turn 50 that it's okay, right? All right, still to come here on the show, we will hear post-game reaction. You get a point. You get a point. Uh, unbelievable performance. Uh, we go to Burlington. We find Brendan. You loving that or what? Yeah, I'm loving it. And I'm loving this rookie. I mean, like, I don't want to say that I'm getting used to it. I'm used to this now. He is... I mean, there's a reason why he is one of the best freshmen in the league, right? And, and this was a case-in-point example of that on the ice. He just looks better than a lot, of, a lot of the other vets out there. Well, I think they clearly hit a home run with this pick, and for him to be even better than they probably expected at this point in his career. Appreciate the call, Brendan. That opens up a line if you want.